on today's episode. The X420 is a vertical takeoff foamy type aircraft and it's pretty much ready to fly. There's just a little bit of assembly to do but nothing very much. It's a battery that I've made up myself. This one included in the kit as well. For the transmitter you're going to need four AA size cells. So I should be using my favorite Any Loops in there. We have propeller guards, the wingtips, a charger, spare props and a screwdriver. That's for assembling the propeller guards, a nose wheel, and finally a vertical stabilizer. Let's get those things put in place. First we install what they're calling the vertical tails and note that there is a small little wheel on one side so that will obviously go for when it's uh, landing horizontally and these should simply slide on like that. Next is the vertical stabilizer, which is just clicked into place in a similar manner. Pushing that forward until it just clicks into place. The landing gear similarly just clicks into place, obviously with the wheel pointing slightly forward. Finally, the propeller guards are simply screwed into place. All done. And note that the little brushed motors have uh, a heat sink on them to help keep them cool, which is a nice touch. And that is all that there is to the assembly. The next step is to check what they call the rudder adjustment, which is the adjustment of the elevons. Turn the transmitter on first, and we get a, a flashing light on there, and then connect the battery. The rapid flashing that you can see is the gyro stabilizing, uh, initializing, and then it goes to this regular flashing to bind it to the transmitter it's full throttle and then back and we heard the beep there and now both lights are steady. To check the movement on the elevons, what I'm going to do is to put it into the horizontal mode which is done by pressing this button on the transmitter here and we get a flashing light and then if we arm it We can now check our movements and they seem to be moving the same amount. Don't believe there's any adjustment needed on that. We're ready to rock and roll. There's a few obstacles around, but no actual runway, so ideal for VTOL. Let's try the one key takeoff, which is the throttle to the mid position and then the trim up. Interesting, it's just pretty much like a drone. Take her up higher and now click for horizontal flight. And landing! Well, it's a good job the thing is EPP. Dumb thumbs, strike again. So let's try the takeoff once more. Throttled midway. Seems to be happier about that. Let's go for horizontal.
Oh, unscheduled landing again. I think the issue is definitely the battery doesn't have enough C rating. It's very, very underpowered. Plus my firing is uh, leaves something to be desired. But being EPP, it seems to be uh, putting up with the abuse very well. Vertical takeoff mode and have one last attempt. You can see what's going to happen here, can't you? <laughs> It does seem to hover very well. And we do have some good degree of control over it. Let's see if we can attempt. A landing. Well, if you can walk away, it's a landing, I guess. Time to get some new batteries ordered, I think. <laughs> 